Hey YouTube, welcome to the channel. We have a very special episode for you today because we're going to reveal some amazing new combos that we've been kind of hiding behind the scenes for a little bit for a special video like this. I'm super excited guys. Let's jump in and check them out. So we're gonna start out with a couple of very special new G-Stripe combos. See what we've done with these. This first one here is Fire Leopard Desert Ghost G-Stripe. So double recessive, double incomplete dominant. We got the Leopard in there, which Leopard is one of the genes that works just absolutely amazing with G-Stripe because it brings in a lot more boldness to the stripe, really accentuates it, gives it some really cool side pattern. And this animal, I love it because it's just so clean and bright. We love the Desert Ghost with the G-Stripe. And we're just trying to figure out really how to manipulate that pattern, which was kind of the whole point of this clutch. We wanted to see what the leopard would do. Of course, we kind of knew what that would do, but we wanted to see what the leopard and the spot nose. We know how transformational leopard and spot nose are together. We wanted to see what that would do in a G-Stripe. And guys, it's amazing. This is the leopard spot nose, desert ghost genetic stripe. And obviously the desert ghost just makes it look amazing. But really what this thing is all about is the leopard and spot nose influence in the G-Stripe, which gives it basically an entire amazing, crazy side pattern all the way down the snake, which is so pretty much out of the question for the G-Stripe stuff for us to be able to see this amount of pattern, this amount of pattern disruption in the animal. And this makes me so excited to see the clown version potentially later on this year. But this snake is just so clean and it's like literally has a crazy webbing all the way down the snake and that stripe just looks incredibly beautiful. So this little gym right here is gonna kick off a journey that's gonna take us all the way to the end of this video. This is gonna start with a special project and we're gonna pivot into the redheads and then move into the strangers and talk about a very special stranger. Let's not move too fast. This is an amazing new special combo. I never really thought the special would end up being such a big part of my season this year. We wanted to see some special clown combos, but I just did not think that they were gonna end up being the wild, amazing, most beautiful animals we've made this year that would be specials. Did not see that coming. It's amazing how these animals continue to surprise us. So this animal right here is the Orange Dream Yellow Belly Cypress Special Clown. And if you guys remember having Eagle Eye, you remember last year we made the Cypress Yellow Belly Special Clown, which is one of the best looking clowns from last year. Just a simple combination that was so bright orange. Well, this is sticking it with one more gene, which is the Orange Dream, which gives it still the same kind of orange look, but gives it an amazing kind of extra brightness on the sides. It really changes the look of it a lot. I really love this animal. I just love how simple it is. That's what special seems to bring to these combos. They're simple, they're kind of subtle, and yet they have this beauty to them. I always think they look like they're painted, almost like with the watercolor. That's kind of what special is bringing to the table on these. It gives them a soft glow and really brings out the colors in other mutations that it's with. So these next two are new redhead combos. We're gonna start with these and how amazing they are. Then we're gonna show you what Special did with redhead because it was really special actually. So check this out. So redhead is really amazing, especially when you have it with spot nose. This is redhead fire spot nose, yellow belly clown. And it's just got great color, very, very unique pattern. Redhead and spot nose really disrupts the pattern and the clown, it really works extremely well. This one is adding one more gene. This is adding red stripe to it. So this is basically like a redhead Pompeii, just minus the black pastel, right? So it doesn't have those rich reds of the Pompeii, but instead it has like light kind of like pale, beautiful tiger striped reds. It's a very, very cool combo. And I love what Redhead's doing. I'm excited about it as a project. I was excited to see the first ones, but I think it's done way more than I ever expected it would in the clown, especially with spot nose. I just keep saying that over and over. It's just a match made in heaven. Now, let's check out the special version. So this may be the most special clown combo I've ever made. That's just a single gene clown with some amazing complete dominance. This thing absolutely glows. Let's look at it close up. So guys, this is probably the most beautiful clown I can remember making in all the years I've made clowns. I don't want to be too hyperbolic, but I think this thing is absolutely insane. I love the combination of the redhead and spot nose just completely whacking out that pattern. But then we have fire and special brightening it all up. When you bring yellow belly in, you get these incredible tangerine medallions all the way down the side. And this is a color I don't think I've really seen much in a clown especially, but in ball pythons in general, just the bright kind of tangerine oranges. It's so different 
than what we've been doing with the clowns of last year's with the really deep kind of oranges from the magma project and the Pompeii and everything. It's so neat to see there's a completely opposite direction. And honestly, we're just bringing together new ingredients. Redhead Spot Nose Clown, Special, which changes the color palette, of course. Yellow Belly brings in the flames. Fire lightens it even more. And the result of the recipe is absolutely, it's amazing. <laughs> love, love this animal. So now we're gonna pivot the redhead into the stranger project. Another big milestone for us this year was combining these two amazing dark mutations into the clown. And honestly, the het clown version, you may actually like it better. So we have two here. This is the het version, spot nose, redhead, stranger het, and then the visual clown version. And I love how these genes interacted. Spot nose, redhead, stranger clown is just crazy, crazy pattern. It's got the beautiful dark, almost dark, almost maze-like, almost like a monsoon almost pattern on the back where it's just so broken up and so weird and so crazy. And then the head version honestly doesn't disappoint at all because it has this beautiful striping and just check out the sides on it. All these little bubbles showing up all the way down the side, different layers of bubbles kind of coming up and like, wow, how cool is that? That's gotta be one of the best hets that I've ever seen. That's just multi codom het clown and it actually gives the visual a run for its money. Love that stripe as well. This is the first big surprise from the Stranger Project for me this year. It was amazing to see kind of this pop out. That one in the Stranger Monsoon, which we showed you recently. But we actually have a big announcement for the Stranger Project that I've been really looking forward to telling you. Okay guys, so I can't believe I'm about to say these words, but this year one of our big goals was to finally do the breedings to prove if there's a super stranger. So right now in my hands, just crawled out this morning, is the very first super stranger. And I don't want to reveal him without a nice shed and him looking really good, all his awesome clutch mates that haven't come out yet. But he should shed out before the Tinley show and I want you guys to come see him at the show in person for the very first time. And for the YouTube audience, we're gonna do a video on it as soon as we get home. Hopefully all shed, can't wait to show you the super stranger. It's worth the wait. Okay guys, that's it. I can't wait to show you all these in person at the show. Come check them out or watch for your friends' pictures online if you happen to miss it, along with our new revealed product, which is Clutch. Can't wait to show you guys and demo it live in person. Come sign up for the beta, check it all out. Can't wait to see you there. Yeah,